Hello guys and welcome back to Star Wars The Old Republic on my Sith Juggernaut Crayol. Sounds like Crayola, didn't I? I don't think I thought that through because that's still very angry. Um, but in the last episode we spotted this woman, this guy here even, and handed in our quest to finish off the round up for this area. So we're going to go back to Barras and see what he's got to say for himself. Um, I will give you an heads up, I haven't played this game for about three weeks now because I got that far ahead with my scheduling that I kind of like had to stop before it got too far ahead. Um, the good thing about that is we're not going to receive stupid amounts of XP anymore so it means that we'll progress normally. But we are six levels above what we should be, well at least six I should say. So therefore we should be alright. Two seconds. I'm back. Sorry, I had to go and turn the heating off because I'm uh, not joking. I'm sweating like I don't know what. Makes me laugh how they put that in green. It's like, it's just not sithy. Um, right, where are we going? Uh, it's over this one. Isn't it? Ooh, you know what we've not got? We haven't got buffs. Sith warrior fears. Always torturing someone again. I don't care what you do. Break my bones. Burn my flesh. I'll tell you nothing. I will not be denied. You tell him, Barris. Go spit, you monster! I didn't know bodies could bend like that. I think I'm gonna be sick. Oh, uh, I don't want to be mean to her. Don't empty your stomach on my boots. Ah, apprentice, you've returned. Commander Bridge confirmed that the slaves have been silenced. Good. I'm still trying to extract the information I crave from this Republic agent. He is much more resilient than anticipated. I thought you said you were good at this. Now <laughs> is not a good time to test me, apprentice. Even as I brutalize him, I twist the force to keep him alive and feeling every sensation. That is the mm. cruelest thing I've ever heard. I have another important task for you. It involves a renegade Sith Lord named Grathen, a particularly bothersome thorn in my side. Meet with my apprentice, Dracul Ball. He's my covert operative in Gratham's compound. Ball claims to have made a key discovery. Invading a Sith compound is my kind of work. Gratham's presence is useful to me, so I don't want him killed, just crippled. Find out what Ball has discovered, and do exactly as he instructs. Too bad. I would love to kill a Sith Lord. <laughs> no doubt someday you will have your chance to try, one way or another. Yeah, he's going to say that we're going to take him down. Big wretch. Where were we? Oh, yes. He looks dead already, though, to me. I think Help he's dead. What I wish to know. Seems like he's straining himself, though, Barris. I think he needs to be careful before he wretches himself. Oh, we got a little treat for that. Hey, thanks. Boom. Uh, which one is it now? Okay, no L, no. I don't know how to do it. It's this one, which is N. Remember N. She's at six. She was only at four last time. What the hell. 3% presence, 9% time efficiency, 3% crit rate, that's just awesome. Alright, let's uh, see what we got to do. Where's, where's this Drick Ball dude? Drick Ball? Let's see where we go, where we got to go. Alright, let's speak to Drick Balls all the way down there. Alright, so I'll tell you what guys, I'm going to meet you down there, I'll be back in two seconds. Alright, so we're here. We're outside uh, that Gratham's estate, and is this 
um, this that drink bell? Already you move through the citadel as if it were yours. Hmm, Perhaps someday it will be. I am the apprentice and voice of Darth Charnas. I speak in his name and I would bargain for your services. If your master needs me, he can come to me himself. Oops, My master off that. prefers to remain in the shadows, but do not doubt his power, nor his ability to reward success. I speak for him. I require individuals capable of gaining prestige in a society weaned on secrecy and madness. Individuals who can earn respect, if not love. I need infiltrators to eliminate an enemy of the Sith. You would serve well. What sort of enemy are you referring to? Our enemy is the Order of Revan. A cult of fools hidden at every stratum of Imperial society. All right. For years, the Revanite heretics have secretly recruited military officers, powerful Sith, wealthy mercenaries, anyone who can add to their power. If they're secret, how do you know anything about them? <laughs> My master has spent many years learning of the Revanites. Together, we have exposed many. Instead of following the Emperor and his Dark Council, the Revanites follow a long-dead Sith Lord, tainted by Jedi ways. If you can uncover the Revanite leader's identity for us, my master will reveal him to the Dark Council. His destruction would be assured. All you have to do is join the cult. I can get you inside, but you must earn their trust. You haven't earned my trust yet. You're making a mistake. My master will richly reward your success, not to mention the satisfaction you'll gain. I'm in, but I have my eye on you. Boom. I'm in audience with their leader. When you have seen his face, return here, and you shall have your reward. I better do. Don't go lightly to liars. What are all these quests now? Alright, let's just have a look. So, speak to Zuzun or whatever his name is. There's Grassham's estate, there's the heroics. Let's see what missions these are all about. Hold your position, please, and keep your weapon holstered. The remotes are scanning you now. You check out. Sorry, my lord. We're on the lookout for anyone with Lord Grathen, and I'm sick of letting him stomp on my people. Some elaboration is required. Hmm. Stick around a minute. I don't know if you're familiar with the situation, but Grathen's a nightmare. The Sith Lord's gone rogue. He's holed up in his estate past the wall. He's got weapons, shields, and a cadre of scientists developing new tech to use against us. Grathen wants respect and authority from the Dark Council, so in true Sith fashion, he turned on his masters to prove his power. As a result, right. we have to put up with this lunacy. So if you're here to cause Grathen problems anyway, you might help us out. I live to serve the Empire. Here's the story. There are nearly a hundred men assigned to this sector, some on the wall, some watching Grathen. Twenty are missing. My men. Practically my kids. Grathen stole them and I want them back. So, what exactly do you want me to do? I don't know what Lord Attitude. Grathen wants with them. Maybe he's holding them hostage just to demoralize us. Who knows? But if you're heading to Grathen's grounds, help them get out. Tell them to report back to their duchess. That's, um, what they call me. I will handle it. I've got reports saying that Grathen's been transporting prisoners to another wing of his estate. I don't know if it's my people he's moving, but it's worth checking out. Watch yourself. Grathen doesn't mess around. All right, then. We can use both of them with that. That's a bonus. Hey. Thanks. Hey, thanks. Hey, no problem. This is great, thanks. No problem. Right, that's a uh, flashpoint. Need the priority missions. So we don't want to be doing any of them. Right, so, um, I'm going to go speak to Zunzun or whatever his name is after. Let's go and complete this heroic. That's what I said we do. Because I like heroics. We get good stuff from them. Uh, so I think we've got, oh, you tell you what, you know what we forgot? we got a speeder! So 
I think we gotta go down. Oh, I'll tell you what. Uh, no, we'll collect that after. Is there any like bonuses or something for killing these homos? Nope, apparently not. Something that we can collect over here though. Alright, so we'll collect that one first. Bet just slosses them, she's mean. She's so mean. Right, now I remember what we're going to do on this one. I hope I know the sys code because, uh, well, quite frankly, we're going to need it. Ooh, it's an elite. I'm so scared. Doing a bit of damage. Not as much as us, but you know, doing some. Nevertheless. Let's back up here now and get the body. Right, so it does look like um, there is planetary quests and uh, class quests because we've got two purple ones now. So that says to me that we've got to do both of them to progress. Okay, that's it. Bring out the big gun. That's a strike. Oosh. Right, where's the body? Where's the body? Found the body. I think there's two more that we've got to get and then that's it. We're done. So there's one over here. May as well kill some stuff on way through. You never know what you're gonna get. There's another one of them slim things. this next one? Why do I get the feeling that it's down here? Because it is down here. Of course it is. Rush for a strike and that I pick it failed. Yep, I mean, we're taking on a lot of damage, but that's because of one reason. We're in a heroic area where you used to not be able to set a single foot without getting slaughtered. So now we need to go over there. So we just kill these guys, but they're elites, so I'm going to heal up. Do we have any, like, buffs or anything? Got an endurance? Not many power ones, do we? No. So I'm going to stick that on. And then we'll stick that on. That's it. 
bet you teach them how it's done. Bet does not mess around. She's a monster. There we go. Getting a nice breeze through now. Finally, I can breathe properly. This is going to be a lot of these cats. Ooh. That's a, a new one. Advanced Extermination. That's because I've very rarely ever done this quest. So obviously you have to kill them little green cat things. I say little, they're actually quite big. <laughs> We're gonna have to do a lot of concentrating on um, the crew skills because um, every time I've leveled up a character, I'm not bothered with it, and it can give you quite a few decent things. So definitely worth doing. Alright, so what do we do now? We have to go over here into a cave. Ooh, cave. Master Strike. Well, I keep calling it Master Strike, but it's Ravage. That's what you get from being used to a sensor. Missed it. See, look at them, they're all in. A little crew together, me just romping it on my own. Um, yep, we can collect that. Somebody misplaced some giant slabs of rock? Hope Treek, we need to send you back out. Minga, minga, treat more back. As soon as I can get some, um, I forgot what they're called now, but basically when we go back to the, what's it called? Imperial Fleet, that's what I was looking for, when we go back there, we need to just go to the crew skill vendors and uh, buy some materials, they're not too expensive so. Right, this is where things get tricky, so... Does that work with Yeah, if it works with that, so we'll use it. So, here we have... A few of the runes. We have... Through victory, match ends are broken. False shot for me, so it's not that one. Do we strength again, power? Peace is a lie, there is only passion. Right, so... It's that one. Peace is a lie, there is only passion. Through passion, I gain strength. Through strength, I gain power. Through power, I gain victory. Through victory, my chains are broken, the force shall free me. Did not see that one or something? Yep, there we go. Now, this is uh, this thing can be pretty powerful, last time I remember. See, no, that's why I want to set you to heal. No! It's going to slaughter me! Well, it's not actually, it's doing practically nothing, so... I'm just going to put my guard on. Look at Vet, she's just absolutely tanking the crap out of it. Like it does nothing. Well, that was a lot easier. You have your reward. Our business Bull is wax, completed. Is that one? Whoa, love stones. What? What are these love stones? Ooh. No problem. What do we get from here? We get a belt, 
and a new shield. Yes, please. That gives us a right boost. We have now become a one hell of a machine. Catching up to vet. Right, so that's that one done. Uh, so, uh, what should we do next? Nell leveled up. Home. Oh. Uh, friends of old and that we're not up to yet. We're going to do Gratham's Est uh No, actually, you know what? Needs. So unfortunately, I'm going to speak to the Revenites. So I'm going to go back to the wall and we're going to go speak to them. Just because of the quest from the Revenites that takes you to the Gratham's Estate. So, two birds, one stone, and all that. So, right, which way do I need to go? This way. Tell you what, it takes a hell of a lot to rank them up, doesn't it, after a while? Why do I keep forgetting I have a speeder? You know what? I think there was a data crunk down on that. Man, it probably was as well. Bagger. It's alright, I can go around and collect them afterwards and they'll do like a roundup of Drummond cars. Just because I'm not 100% sure on where the datacons are anyway. Ooh, some materials. Let's go and get them. Where have they gone? There they are. It's definitely worth collecting them while you can because... Just send him back out. Yeah, yeah. Right, where are we going? Yeah, it's this way. This reminds me of the swoop bracer off uh, Kotor. It's funny. Which you will be able to see in one of my other videos that type that's already uploaded. You curious? I have took Kotor off the schedule for now, but it's just because it's such a pain to record. So I'm gonna I'm gonna still do it, but it's gonna be off schedule if that makes sense. Here we go. Where are you? At? Speak to Dozen. Did you lose your way in the jungle? You have my sympathies, but we can't help. We have no food or water to offer. There's nothing for you here, and strangers are not welcome in this place. You'd best be going. I was given this token. Does it tell you anything? Of course it I'm does. Not sure. Ah, you do have the token. Someone must have had great faith in you to send you our way. Welcome to the Order of Revan, Initiate. Welcome to your new life. Why didn't you say you were a Revanite in the first place? You must know by now that our ways are secret. We have enemies who believe we should be silenced. This place is our haven, built by the Master and protected by the faithful. Here we leave our duties to the Empire behind. This is where the Master guides us in the mysteries of Revan, the one who began a Jedi, but grew into a Sith, and then something more. Why would a Jedi join the Sith? And what do you mean by something more? As a Jedi, Revan was a warrior who slaughtered armies. As a Sith, Revan was a teacher who trained a thousand dark apprentices. Eventually, Jedi and Sith both turned on Revan. But instead of being destroyed, Revan was reborn. You're talking about a myth. <laughs> it may sound like a myth, but it's true. Revan was stripped of power, stripped of life, of memory, and left to rot. And still, Revan relearned the ways of the Force. The reborn Revan destroyed Jedi and Sith, and came to Drummond Kars. Although Revan's life ended here, the Master preserved that life, so that we may learn from it. If Revan was a destroyer, then I will learn your teachings. <laughs> Revan mastered the light side and the dark side, war and peace. We seek to walk the same path. Take part in our rituals, learn Revan's path to greatness, succeed, and you earn the right to join us. Then I look forward to learning. Around you, you'll find your new teachers, Revanites who have spent their lives recovering the works of Darth Revan. Speak to them. Complete the tasks you are given. When you are through, return to me. And the master will give you your final lessons. All right then. 
900 freaking thingy with that, that's awesome. Right, we've got another uh, yeah, getting attack just to cool down a force charge by one second. The effect can occur more than once every four rage when stunned him over. Uh, no, Ravage mobilizes the target for the duration, duration of the ability. The ability that could be quite um, decent. No. Taking the choice one rage. No. Force charge cancel stop for the granting any which is movement repair and effects and effects that push or pull you for around four seconds. Sweeping slash deals twenty five percent more damage. Quite like that one, because then it means that I can use force charge more often. So look at how vet's doing. Ooh, she's nearly rank seven. Let's go and see what we gotta do next with this. Come here, come closer. You are among the initiates who wish to join our order, and this is good. Very good. But tell me something. You are here because of the Order of Revan. Are you ready to die for us? You totally lost me. <laughs> Consider carefully, for every Revanite must face the trial of death, just as Revan died at the hands of the Jedi and Sith. Death freed Revan, left him unbound from all oaths and promises. It paved his road to rebirth. Will death free you from your past? Let me be clear. I'm not going to. <laughs> Do not be frightened. Change is nothing to fear. Before us is a path. Beyond the path is a cave. A cave dedicated to Darth Revan. Initiates fall on the path. Initiates are torn apart by things inside the cave. But initiates who reach the end are reborn. Remade. Tell me more of this. Go. And you'll see. The path is here. I think he's trying to kill us. The cave. The cave will be more trying. The tougher, the better. Remember, survival is not your goal. Trust in the path of Darth Revan. We have nothing more to discuss. Go and return to me when you reach the end of the cave. I will. Keep bringing that stuff back, Treek. Uh, right, we've got some stuff, so we can use that on it. Hey, can thanks. use that on it. This is great, thanks. Can use that. Yeah, there we go, she's rank 7. Hey, thanks. Don't think we've got any more up with. No. So let's have a look at um, what she gets now. So, 10.5% time efficiency, so she gets 10% off, so that's like 2 minutes on the end game ones. 3.5% so crit for crew skill tasks, so that's quite high. We're getting to the point now where it's like literally higher than what it used to be. So let's go over to this cave that they're all going on about. You know what? We've not seen. Single server mastery. For my time sent and grants bonus based on your currently active farm. Nice. Yeah, we got faster pilot speeder now. So, um There's your little story about her as well. Alright, let's kill these droids. Smash! Oosh. Took some work. Mm, it really didn't vet, it really didn't. Where are we at? We're at, um... This so-called Revan's Cave. Don't see anything special about it just yet. I don't know if you think it looks any decent. Is that 
Revan? Impressive secret shrine thingy. Looks me out of the There it is, Revan's mask. That's creepy, I don't think. Pathetic, the fact that they couldn't stay stood. Beep. Interesting. The fact that um, I could hear beeping, I don't know if that was just me. <laughs> Hoping it wasn't. <laughs> Dripping with the blood of the womb, you are reborn. Your old life, everything you were, all of it is dead, buried inside that cave. Of course, whatever you say. <laughs> you are free now, free of everything you once were. Savor the moment, it won't come again. You sound right, it Tell won't. Tell me how it feels. Your obligations have vanished. Your past no longer burdens you. How does it feel to see the world reborn? Like I've never killed before. You've done well, and I'm proud that you've begun your new life as a Revenite, choosing allegiance to us first of all. Take this gift Not to guide sure you that. in your new life. It will remind you of what you've become. Leave now, and may the Force make you strong. It's like one reward. I need that. I need that. Shall we take that? Thank you very much. Influence 400. Nice. I'm not going to level up scavenging anymore at the moment because, well, quite frankly, we don't need it. What levels? Being a 50% presence when summoned. So she got a little bit more health, but not Come much. Come forward. Speak to me. We're all students of Darth Revan, and I enjoy the company of initiates. I remember when I was like you. I remember my trials and the joy of killing in the master's name. You're so fortunate. It is a certainty. Good. No. Even if you fail your tests, feel lucky to have participated. I'm Ladra, once the personal assassin of a Sith Lord. I am now the serene protector of the master and his students. I contemplate Revan's teachings as I execute intruders and heretics. But I also guide initiates and help determine their trials. Your wisdom must be great, Ladra. <laughs> Will you share it? I've pissed off that big time this time. Honor the master. Every Revanite's initiation includes a trial of the past, a right to bind the initiate to Revan. Your right will be very special. You will find the mask of Darth Revan, what he wore after becoming Sith. It's a powerful symbol of his greatness, long lost to us. There is no point to any of this. <laughs> Don't talk like that. The mask represents Revan's supreme essence. Besides, if you don't complete your initiation, you'll have to die. The mask is in a collection of antiquities possessed by my former teacher, the Sith Lord Grathom. Of course. It must be freed from that heretic, rescued in a reign of blood and death. Why are you so interested in it? I'll give it a place of honor here in the compound, of course, so every Revanite can see it. Speak to Torun, our curator. He'll give you the spiritual guidance you need and tell you where the mask is. When your journey's done, bring the mask to me. Good luck. Welcome the peace that comes with serving the master. I am the master. So let's um, speak to this guy. What have we got here? I wasn't expecting a visit from any initiates, but you're welcome to stay and talk, in any case. I'm Tarun, devoted servant of the Master and student of Revan. What can I do for you? I'm searching for Darth Revan's mask. I'm told you can help. So, Ladra sent you. 
She wants me to ritually prepare you for contact with Revan's mask, eh? A pointless ceremony. Ladra's devoted to the Revanites. She's also obsessed with that mask. Says it talks to her. Oh, okay. Ladra wants the mask to represent Explains everything it. Revan ever was, but he wasn't just Sith. Before his rebirth, he was both Sith and Jedi. I can tell from talking to Ladra that she's lost her mind. I'm glad you noticed. There is a fine line between worship and mindless obsession. It's tempting to seek answers in material objects. Ladra will use the mask to teach that Revan was a being of only darkness. I don't want that mask becoming our order's sole focus. Bring it to me. I'll keep it safe among a few like-minded scholars. Sounds like you'll benefit from this as well. I'm not after the mask for myself. I have no use for it, except for what it represents. I'm sure Ladra promised a grand reward for the mask. I can't match it, but I can promise your initiation will proceed smoothly. Will you help me preserve the real Revan? Or will you let Ladra overshadow everything with a Sith relic? I'll bet that mask would look good on me. Hey. It's in any condition to wear. Still, that would be better than giving it to Ladra. I'd like to do that. Keep it to myself. I don't have to tell you to be careful, but may the Force be with you. May it keep you strong and guide your return. Clearly you used to be a Jedi. That's all I'm going to say. <laughs> right, so... We've got to go to... Gratham's estate now. Yes, oh, boom. We've got some Agridium. That's it. That's how it's pronounced in it. I think it is. Bring me more. Treat. Vehicle pads are currently open for business. What planet are we on next? I can't think. I don't know, but either way, it'll be fun. We've got 1500 cartel coins. As soon as we get enough money, we'll start like going into um, these, buying some of these. We've obviously already got one drama on cast, Datacron. We've got the Korriban ones. Um, right, anyway, guys. Uh, I'm going to leave Grassham's Estate for the next episode. Um, we'll complete a few more quests while we're in there. Probably level up again. Um, yep. So stick around to see how the story develops. Ooh. I'll see you next time. Don't forget to subscribe for more.